Dieu va arriver. Welcome to GeoByte. Hi children. Today let us know about long and short. In this video, let us cover the topics how far apart are the dots, the shorter line, try this and how tall have you grown. Now let us get into the topic how far apart are the dots. Hey children, we have a box here. In this box, we have some dots. Children, now you need to guess the distance between any two dots from this box. How many centimeters is it? Let us guess. I will take this dot and this dot that is dot A and dot C. Now, I will guess the distance. I guess it is 19 centimeters. Now you need to measure these two dots with the scale. Then did you guess right? Let us check. First let us measure the distance between dots A and C. It is 19 centimeters. Yes, I have guessed it correct. So, it is 19 centimeters. Yes, I have guessed it right. Children, we have a question here. Let us see the question. Which two dots do you think are farthest? From each other. Check your answer. I think. Yes. The dots H and D are farthest from each other. Let us check by measuring the distance between H dot and D dot. Yes, 30 plus 24. So I got 54 centimeters. I think this is only the farthest distance. So, dots, H and D are farthest. From each other. Children, we have another question here. Let us see the question. Which two dots do you think are nearest to each other? Check your answer. I think the dots F and M are nearer. Let us measure the distance between the dots F and M. Yes, the distance between F and M is 5 centimeters. Five centimeters is the distance between F and M. Now, let us get into the topic, the shorter line. Children, there was 
a famous king Akbar. He had a smart minister called Birbal. Once Akbar gave a difficult question to Birbal. He drew a line on the floor like this. This is Akbar's line. Then Akbar said, Birbal, here is a line on the floor. Now you need to make this line shorter without erasing. Then Birbal thought in a smart way and has drawn longer line. This is Birbal's line. So children, see, Birbal has drawn a longer line than Akbar's line. Now, Akbar's line is shorter than Birbal's line. He thought in a smart way. Now, can you be as smarter as Birbal? Can you make Birbal's line shorter without erasing? Just think. Is there any other longest line? Yes, we can make Birbal's line shorter by drawing the longest line. Let us draw. Yes, now Birbal's line has become shorter. So there is such Longest line. Now, let us try this. Children, we have few questions. Let us see the first question. Make her right arm one centimeter longer than her left arm. Let us make. First, let us measure the length of her left arm. Yes, it is 22 centimeters. Now, let us make this right arm 23 centimeters as we need to draw 1 centimeter extra. So, Now, I have made her right arm 1 cm longer than her left arm. I have measured her left arm and made 1 cm longer, that is the right arm. Children, now let us see the next question. Draw a cup. One centimeter shorter than this cup. Let us draw. First, let us measure the length of this cup. Yes, this cup is of length 28 centimeters. As we need to draw one centimeter shorter than this cup, let us draw a cup of length 27 centimeters. First, let us see. Yes, now let us draw a cup in between these two points. This is of length 27 centimeters.
children i have drawn a cup of length 27 cm which is 1 cm shorter than this cup which is of 28 cm children we have another question here let us see the question draw a broom half as long as this broom let us draw children to draw the broom half as long as this broom we need to measure the length of this broom after measuring only we can be able to draw half the length of the broom first let us measure the length 30 plus 30 plus 4 so it is 30 plus 30 plus 4 it is 64 see we got length as 64 we need to draw half the length so half means 64 by 2 2 1s are 2 2 3s are 6 2 2s are 4 so 64 by 2 is 32 that is half in 64 is 32 so let us measure 32 and draw the broom Two. Yes, now we will draw the broom. So children, we have drawn the broom with half the length of this broom. That is, this broom is of 64 centimeters. In 64, half is 32. So I have drawn this broom with 32 centimeters. Children, now let us see the last question. Draw another hair of double the length. Children, let us draw. See, here we have a grandfather and he has only one hair. Let us measure the length of the hair first. Then we can draw double the length of that hair. First, let us measure this hair. This is of... 7 centimeters. So, double means 7 into 2. Double means 2 times. Either we can write 7 into 2 or 7 plus 7. Now, 7 twos are 14. 7 plus 7 is also 14. So, double the length means it is 14 centimeters. Let us mark a point 14 centimeters and draw another hair that is making double length. Yes, now let us draw the hair. Yes, we have drawn the hair double the length of this hair. Now, let us get into the topic. How tall have you grown? Children, we have 
three questions here. Let us see each question one by one. First, let us see the first question. Do you remember that in class 3 you measured your height? Yes, you remember that you measured your height in class 3. Let us write. Yes, you remember that you measured your height. In class 3. Children, now let us see the second question. Do you think you have grown taller? Yes, you have grown taller. Let us write. Yes, you have grown taller. Now, let us see the next question. How much and dash centimeters? Children, you might have grown 5 centimeters more. That is 5 centimeters about 5 centimeters. The remaining topics will be covered in the next video. You are welcome to contact us on Telegram to clarify your doubts regarding these topics. Check out the link in the description. Thank you for watching. Please do like, share, comment and subscribe to Geobyte. Geobyte.